Hey everyone, what's up? It's your boy Go Blue here, and today I got another zombies video for you. And I want to talk about some good news, bad news thing. So I was doing some searching, and I found this article that um, came out, and it came out in uh, November of 2020, um, about the DLC maps for zombies. And first we're going to talk about the good news of the article. And it talks about the four DLC maps that will be coming out. And again, it is just an article, so it could be fake, you know. Yeah, or it could just not be fake, but it could be, you know, just rumors. It might not be real, it might not be true. But the thing is, as I've shown you in the screen down, the reason why I like this article and I'm making a video about it is, and they talked about the four maps coming out, and the first one they talked about was a map in Vietnam. And it's called Firebase Z, which has been confirmed. That's real. So this article that came out in November had already pretty much put it out. And, that, and the first one's real. It's correct. And I guess um, all, the, all four of the locations are actually in the, the very first tra trailer that came out for Zombies. The theatrical trailer. And it shows on the computer screen where all the locations would be. Maybe not the names, but the lo locations. And they were right in the first one. It's Firebase Z in Vietnam. So it made me think that maybe the rest of this article is right. Maybe the other maps are correct. We're not, you know, who knows. So it talks about that, but then it also talks about Berlin and about Kino, that being the Kino do, do Turton remake. And that's pretty much always already been confirmed. So this article is kind of two for two right now. Uh, it talks about the uh, Berlin and because that is where Kino's at and that, that map is coming out. So that's really cool. But the thing is that it mentions it in different order. Again, who knows if this is the correct order, but they said Fire Team would be coming out first, and that is coming out first. And it says that the next zombie map will be in uh, the location will be Russia. Now, it does not have a, um, a name for the map. Uh, it might be called Fire Teams, but that's also something that has to do with the war zone. But maybe that is the name of the zombie map. But they said that it, the next one's supposed to be Russia. So, maybe that's not a remake at all, which, I mean, it's probably not. I mean, I don't think this Fire Team based one's going to be a Shangri-La remake. There was uh, some rumors of a Shangri-La remake, but I really don't think it's this one, even though it's in the jungle, like Shangri-La was. I, uh, from the map, from the overhead map, it just doesn't look like it. Now, I guess it could be, but it really doesn't look like it. But that's not what I'm here to talk about, but this, they say the second one coming out is going to be a map based in Russia. So, maybe that's our second one. And the thing is, we probably won't find out about that for a while. I think they normally do these maps, pack things, especially for zombies, about, what, two, maybe three months apart. So maybe in April we, we'll know. Maybe in April we'll find out about it. And then maybe we'll actually get the second map. I'm not sure. So, but maybe that happens. And then the third one, you know, is the, uh, you know, I said the third one is the Berlin one with Kino, which is cool. So, like I said, it's been like a good article that's been pretty true. And then it talks about a, uh, the fourth map. And it says that the fourth map is called Giant. Codename Giant. Um, <laughs> now... I really hope that it's not just another giant remake, you know, because we've already had that map. Original Call of Duty, Black Ops 2, Giant. We've already had it three times, so if this is a remake of the Giant, um, that'd be four times we've had this map because it's on the it's on the original Call of Duty. It's in Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2. Actually, it'd be the fifth time, right? Yeah, it was in Black Ops 4. I mean, it was not. It was in Black Ops 3. So we've had this map a lot. Now, I hope that... It's called Giant. It's not called The Giant, but it's called Giant, it says. It's code name. Hopefully it's not that map. Even though that is a good map and all. I mean, it's, it was the first map that had a Wonder Weapon on it. Well, I mean, Ray Gun was in them, but like a real Wonder Weapon, you know. Not a Ray Gun. It was the first one that had a had the Wonder Waffle on it. And, uh, I mean, it's cool. It's a great map. I just hope that it's not that map, though, because we've played a lot. Uh, I'm sure the thing is though if it is that map it's probably uh, really extended like uh, Notch was and like Kino will probably be so it's not going to be a total remake but anyways this, this, and then this article if it's true it says the last one's called Giant 
and it talks about maybe it's just like a big maybe you just fight a big giant zombie that evolves around you know the dark ether and everything but who like who knows what you have to do in it but I just hope that it's not that map you know the giant we've had that map a lot in zombies it's a great map but we've had it a lot like if you're gonna give us more remakes even though Kino will be coming out for the third time give us other ones give us new ones or just give us Chronicles too. Really, that's all we. That's what, that's what we really need. But anyways, the the good part of the video is that this article has been kind of true, and hopefully, it, it stays true. That yeah, we're getting four maps, and that these are kind of the names of them. You can give you some idea what they might be for the future. So that's cool. I'm excited for that. I am even if it's like a remake. I'm excited because I really do like this year's zombies. It's just there's only one map, and that really sucks. But here comes the bad part of it. It only talks about four DLC maps. It doesn't talk about anything else. Uh, now, as we know, uh, it's just an article. It could be doesn't mean it's real. It could be fake. Uh, it might not be, not, might not be all true. So there could be obviously more more maps to come. And there's no reason to think that there couldn't be. But man, with the way things are this with zombies this year, I'm afraid that there's only going to be four maps added to the game. So that means there's only going to be five total, which that would be the lowest amount of zombie maps for a Treyarch game. Which doesn't make sense to me. Because I feel like as time goes on, especially in this day and age where it's all about DLCs and keeping games going, I just don't know why there wouldn't be more. Like, there should be, it should be increased. And Zombies is a really popular game mode. Uh, it still has a big fan base and I just don't get why they would not put more maps out than that. So I really hope that's not the case. I hope that it's not just one multiplayer, one, one map at launch, and then four DLCs, and that's it. It's over. Now, I do believe that if they were going to release a Chronicles 2 or some kind of big remaster maps, they would keep it under wraps as best they could. They probably would not want people to know that for a while until towards the end. And I hope that's the case. Like I said, I hope Chronicles 2 drops. I never understood why they didn't do it in Black Ops 4. And it needs to be done. So let's hope that they put that out. <laughs> Uh, so that's like kind of the bad part. It's a good good news that it's cool to see some some information about the upcoming DLCs. It's good to to see some names and try to think of some things and visualize it. But then it's bad to think: is that it though? Is that the only thing they're doing? Is that all they're gonna do? Is have four maps for DLC in the mainstay and then that's it? Because uh, they're getting a lot of maps in multiplayer, and I. I mean, I guess it's probably easier to deal for most players. They don't have to think of a storyline, I guess. But, man, they really need to have more than just just four. Like I said, what they really need to do is do two maps every DLC drop that they do. One complete, normalized remaster, and then a new one. That's what they need to do. But they're not doing that. I highly doubt it. Anyways, so that's what I want to make a video about. I saw this article. I thought it was interesting because it gives us some some insight for the future of zombies hope you guys enjoyed the video i had fun making it it's your boy go blue and i'm out